Next in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can quickly set up the Samsung Galaxy S23 or the S23 Ultra. So the purpose of this video is just to quickly set up the device. So what I want to do is first insert the SIM card at the bottom using the SIM pin and then pull out the SIM tray. We'll put the SIM card into the SIM tray with the metal contact facing up. Now insert the SIM card into the SIM slot at the bottom and push the SIM tray all the way in. On the side here, press and hold on the power button or the side button to switch on the phone. Once you see it says Samsung Galaxy, we, you can let go of the button and allow the phone to boot up. So this is the first time I have, uh, I'm going to set up this device. So give it a few seconds. Next, if your SIM has a SIM pin, put in the SIM pin and tap on OK. From the welcome screen, select a language and tap on the start button. So select a language and tap on the start button. Next, tap on agree. Go down here and choose what you want to agree and tap on agree button at the bottom. Next, it says, do you want to set up using another device? So here you can choose a Galaxy or Android device or iPhone. This will allow you to copy uh, settings, accounts, and more data from other devices. I'm going to tap on the skip for now, just so that we can quickly get to the home screen. Now in here, tap on the Wi-Fi that you want to connect to and put in the Wi-Fi password. Okay, once you have put in the Wi-Fi password, tap on the connect button and then tap on next. And now say service provider setup, checking service provider information. This could take a few minutes. After that, it says your phone needs to restart. So go ahead and tap on the restart button. After that, it says getting your phone ready. And again, it will take a few minutes. At this page, it says copy apps and data. I'm going to choose don't copy for now. We can always do that later on in settings. Next, it says checking info. Okay, on the next screen, it asks you to sign into your Google account. And again, you do not need to sign in right now. If you want, you can sign in with your Google account. I'm going to tap on the skip button and then tap on skip. Then tap on more, more and accept. Now, it asks, do you want to protect your phone with a password or a pin? I'm going to tap on skip for now and then tap on skip anyway. Next is the Samsung account. It asks, do you want to sign to your Samsung account right now? I'm going to tap on skip and we can always sign to your Samsung account later on in settings. Now tap on skip and tap on more and agreed. And here we can choose light or dark theme and tap on next. And that's it, it's a your all set up. Now we can tap on the finish button to finish off. After the phone, uh, after you get to the home screen, you can see here on the status bar, your phone's still trying to uh, complete the setup on the background. So allow it to install all the required applications on the background. However, on the home screen, you can now start to browse around and see what is available on your new Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra or the, uh, or the normal Galaxy S23 or the 23 Plus. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. Now, if later on you need to go in and set up your uh, Samsung or Google account, you can go in settings and in settings, you can sign to your Samsung account here, or you can go down and tap on accounts and backup and then tap on manage accounts. In here, you can add in your Google account. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video.